This is Apollo Saturn Launch Control, T-minus one hour, nine minutes, 59 seconds, and counting. At this time, in the command module, Odyssey, the three crewmen, spacecraft commander Jim Lovell, command module pilot Jack Swigert, and lunar module pilot Fred Hayes are very busy. Uh, the spacecraft commander and command module pilot are configuring the stabilization and control system for liftoff and aligning that system with the guidance platform aboard the spacecraft. Also going on at this time is a check of the large propulsion system engine up below the service module. This engine can be gimbaled in response to commands. This is done in, in two ways, and these systems are being checked out at this time. Is there is a thumb wheel control which can set the engine to, to a preset position for certain maneuvers, and also a rotational hand controller which can be used for the actual flight of a maneuver. These checks are being made now, the engine being gimbaled with spacecraft commander Jim Lovell indicating the position that he is putting these to, and readouts are being made to ensure that the engine is gimbling in proper response. Also at this time, a final check out by the crew of the entry monitoring system. Also a final setting of this system. Our countdown proceeding well at this time, T minus one hour, eight minutes, 40 seconds. This is Kennedy Launch Control. This is Apollo Saturn Launch Control. We're just passing the one hour mark in our countdown. Now in the final hour of the countdown toward the launch of Apollo 13. The closeout crew has now left the white room area and will be standing by for the retraction to the 12 degree position of swing arm number nine. Now at T minus 57 minutes, 15 seconds and counting, this is Kennedy Launch Control. This is Apollo Saturn Launch Control as we move into the final half hour of our countdown. T minus 29 minutes, 56 seconds and counting. The Brevard Sheriff's Department, Brevard County, Florida, has reported that along Route 1, the closest major highway to Kennedy Space Center, there are some 100,000 people and 25,000 cars parked watching for the launch of Apollo 13. Along the Indian and Banana Rivers, it's reported that the both rivers are literally filled with boats and spectators standing by to watch the launch. Our countdown continuing now. The power transfer test underway. T minus 29 minutes, 13 seconds and counting. This is Kennedy Launch Control. This is Apollo Saturn Launch Control. T minus nine minutes, 58 seconds and counting. The third stage start tanks are now beginning their chill down. Third stage scheduled to ignite at nine minutes, 22 seconds into the mission. Also going on at this time is one of the computer checks which are carried out throughout the final portion of the launch. This particular one is a check out of the launch vehicle digital computer to ensure that it's ready for launch. A final check of the weather indicates that uh, earlier worries about the weather have come to naught. Weather looks good and is satisfactory, presents no constraint to our launch. Now T minus nine minutes, 25 seconds and counting. This is Kennedy Launch Control. We're now approaching the T minus one minute mark. T minus one minute, T minus one minute and counting. Now in the final minute of our countdown, at the 30 second mark, swing arm number one will retract. T minus 50 seconds, as we pass the T minus 50 second mark, the power transfer takes place. First stage, second stage, third stage, and the instrument unit going to internal power. T minus 37 seconds, and our count continues to go well. We'll be looking for an ignition of those five first stage engines at the T-minus 8.9 second mark. We've passed T-minus 30, T-minus 25 seconds and counting, and Apollo 13 is go. T-minus 20 seconds, T-minus 20 seconds and counting. 17, guidance release, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. Ignition sequence has started.
at one, we show the captain relieving. 13, Roger. 13, Houston, standby for mode one, Charlie. Mark, you're one, Charlie. Mark, one, Charlie. And 13, you're go for staging. Go for staging. Trajectory's good. Thrust is good. Roger. Skirt. Tower jet. We confirm skirt step. Roger. Tower jet. Mode 2, Jim. Looking good. Mode 2. Guidance initiate. 13 Houston coming up five minutes. You're looking perfect. Over. 13, Roger. Stand by for S4B to orbit. Mark, you have S4B to orbit, Jim. Roger, we have S4B to orbit. 13, Houston, you are go for staging. 13, Roger, go for staging. Staging. Roger, staging. And S4 ignition, Houston. Roger that, Jim. Thrust looks good. Roger. Apollo 13, uh, Houston, your go at 11 and a half, and predicted cutoff time is 12 plus 3, 4, over. Understand 12 plus 3, 4, predicted cutoff time. Apollo 13, Houston, you have a go orbit all sources and the booster is safe, over. Go orbit and the booster is safe, thank you, Joe. Don't mention it. 